Today's tryout day. The big is what Mike and I are doing today. Katie, Katie, how'd it go? Uh, may I extend my curfew? Good morning, my guy. What's up, ladies and gentlemen? Are you ready to go? I am ready to go. All right, let's turn your lights off. Ryan, well, I'll let him tell you what he's doing today. What are you doing today, Ryan? Uh, I am going to the beach. All right, with who? Yeah, my boys, Miller, Christian, and Charlie. Oh my gosh. Four 13-year-old boys rocking the beach. Going to the beach. Going to the beach. This is sort of a... Not rocking the beach. Um, cover your ears. For a second. This is a last trip before school starts. Kind of. Stop! Oh, sorry. You really sorry. think I was gonna actually cover my ears? Right? I don't know. I, it was worth a try. Stop! Stop! Right. I'm, I'm looking <laughs> at you. I'm, gonna, I'm driving myself to Miller's house. Okay, bye. So, ladies and gentlemen, we have acquired Charlie. Actually, we're kidnapping him. Uh, so, we're almost to my friend Miller's house, and then we're gonna go to the beach. So, I'm gonna try to get some vlogs on my phone so you guys can see what it's like. But, uh, we're almost there, so looking forward to it. Charlie, what's your thoughts? Um, yay. Are you excited? Yeah, I'm excited. What are you most excited for? We only get the best from Charlie. The, the beach. The beach. <laughs> right. Sounds right. Good. The, beach, the beach part You're of the beach. You brought his But, okay. So, me and Charlie are hyped up. And uh, we're turning into his house now, I think. Actually, no. We're turning into the road that goes to his house. That, let's turn into the road that goes to his driveway that goes to his house that goes to his living room. All right. It's just me here except Katie just came home. Hi, Kate. Hi. What you looking for? My socks. Oh, Katie had to come get her cheer shoes. You know why, you guys? Today's a big day. You want to tell him, Katie? You want me to tell Cheer tryouts. Yay! It's nice. You're number two, baby. Oh, yeah. I'm excited. Why? Um, because I really, really liked cheering last year. Yeah? And we have new coach, new program, new head of, what's it called? Athletic director. Athletic director. So I'm really excited. Yeah, it's going to be good. Yep. You've been doing cheer workouts and stuff. Yep. Getting ready. Yep. Let's get this over with, man. Let's go through tryouts and let's start this thing. We're let's get pretty it. sure Kate's gonna make the change. I, I have like no that. idea where my spandex are. I literally did you take them? I, I did not take them. Of course not. How then many where do they go? I, I have know. like twelve pairs of spandex. Yeah, I have So then no my point idea. is since you can't find them, they must be somewhere all together. Like they must have but somewhere. I why, why would I put them all together? I, I don't know. We have to search though. Cause you need them. All right, so Katie is, um, actually I think you're spending the day with your friends Natalie and Dana, right? Getting ready for tryouts? Yep. Very good. So maybe we'll see some from Kate and see what she looks like before she goes and hear about the, what she's excited about and then afterwards how tryouts go. I don't think you're allowed to take a camera how into tryouts, is that true? I do not have one Katie? pair of spandex. Are you, you're not allowed to take a camera into tryouts, is that correct? Why would I bring a camera into tryouts? Well, that's what I'm just telling everybody. They probably won't see tryouts. No, there's no way. You won't see tryouts, but you'll see other stuff. Really, though? Where are Okay, where I'm going to go try to help Katie find her fans. Bye, guys. Hey, guys. It's me, Natalie, and Dana. We all just woke up <laughs> from a nap. <laughs> Today is tryout day. Yay. We all look, you look super excited, Natalie. I can't wait. You're lying. You're nervous. Mm -hmm. Are you nervous? <laughs> no. We're just tired, bro. We're so <laughs> tired. Like, the past years, we've always had it, like, in the beginning of the day, and it's at 5 o'clock, and we've been sleeping all day. So. We literally woke up, got bagels, and just, for the rest of the day, been watching Netflix. What time is it? 3.30. So we have to leave here in, like, an hour. Is anybody else trying out at the same time as us, or is it just cheer? No, it's just cheer. Everybody had, like, first stuff. Everybody did theirs in the morning. And it was the whole school tries out for all the sports on these three days. So we're doing it. We're like today is like a clinic and then tomorrow is also a clinic. Can you break? No. Oh. <laughs> Can you? Like my hair. No. And the actual trial day is Wednesday. Why are you like <laughs> doing <laughs> just like somewhere else right now? I'm so tired. Do you have anything to say to the people? I'm really scared for tryouts. Okay, guys. Well, we'll see you when we're all ready to go. <laughs> Wish us luck. Are you ready? <laughs> yeah. You did her hair and everything. Look. 
and her makeup. I have we have white shirts and short black shorts because that's what we're supposed to do. I can't. You can't even see my face. What is up with this camera, bro? <laughs> <laughs> Bye. All right, you guys, it's a big day for the Donnellys. As you know, Katie's trying out for cheerleading. Ryan went to the beach with his friends. Brennan went on the boat, not to lunch with his friends. But that's not big. The big is what Mike and I are doing today. You ready? Time to go to the next side. <laughs> okay. So there is a, I've been bragging about this Mexican restaurant that I like locally, and my friends are like, Ugh. That's nothing compared to the Mexon. I'm like, what do you mean Mexon? Well, apparently our Exxon, our local gas station, has a really good Mexican restaurant inside it, but I don't even know if it's a restaurant. We've lived here for 20 years? Yes, this year will be 20 years. Mm. We've never known about it, and today is the first day we're gonna go try it. So I don't even know if they still serve dinner or not. Like if they only serve lunch, apparently. They also have live bait, which is good. They have live bait, so we can go in and get Mexican food and live bait. All right, so we're gonna go in and um, hopefully they have some food left for us. <laughs> Woo, you guys, we made it. Kind of belted in. Yes, belted in. Now I will tell you, we were a little bit late for the enchiladas. They were out of the enchiladas today. So I had to get a case of weed instead. But look at that, yes, you know, some safe back there. <laughs> so we got three meals, one for me, one for Mike, and one for Brennan. But Mike said he's gonna eat for them. So we'll see. I'm pretty excited about it. Ah, so it in fact is, wait, hold on, a Mexican restaurant inside the gas station, which I have to say on a side note, I was up way too late last night watching a show on the History Channel called The Food That Built America. If you guys haven't seen that, it's really good. It's about Milton Hershey and C.W. Post from like Post Cereals. Carl Sanders. Hold on, I'm getting there. Oh, sorry. Um, the Kellogg Brothers. Oh. The Mars Sun and and dad, who else? Oh, Bird's Eye. There was actually a guy named Bird's Eye. You know, he does really? the frozen food. Yeah, it's, I'll tell you that story. Is it's his crazy. Name Bird? No, his name is Clarence Bird's Eye. Really? Yes, he, oh, he pioneered frozen name. food. Yes. And I think he was born in Alaska. That might be why his name is Bird's Eye. I kind of missed that. But anyway, um, and Colonel Sanders. And Colonel Sanders, if you know, is KFC Kentucky Fried Chicken. And he started his restaurant in a gas station. Dad wants to be in the film too. <laughs> anyway, so Colonel Sanders started his restaurant yeah. in a gas station also. So maybe we might be, you know, at the start of something good. But I think this has been going on for a really long time. Oh, now it's just me. Oh, okay. All right, bye guys. We'll share your food when we get home, if that's what you want to see. Katie's still at tryouts, which it goes until, oh, for another 15 minutes. Should we stop by the high school and see if we can see her? Oh, I don't think she'd like that. She'd be mad. No. All right, I can't wait to hear all that. I have really good news. Do you want to show yours? Oh, oh my gosh. my gosh. Holy Doesn't that look beautiful? Dad got tacos. Okay, that's right. I got a place where quesadilla. Okay, that's a lot of food. <laughs> but doesn't that look good? Mm-hmm. All right, yeah. here's to um, gas station uh, Mexican food joints. Boom. Boom. Hi. There's Katie Donnelly. Hi, Welcome guys. home. Thanks. Uh, who's upstairs? Brandon just went up. He's getting all the garbage because tomorrow's garbage day. Interesting. Katie, how are tryouts? I need to put this bag down and then I'll let you know. Oh, fantastic. Katie, Katie, how'd it go? It was good. It was? Yeah. What'd you guys do? Um, we started with tumbling. Nice. nice. And then we did... Jumbling. <laughs> no, it's not that. We did tumbling and then we did stunting and then we did... Oh, wow. And then we learned to cheer and then we learned to dance. Really? In two hours? Yeah. That's pretty good. How many people were there? Um, I'd say 50. Holy cow, wow. really? Yeah. That's Is that more or less than last year? Um, about the same. Okay. Anybody um, new, like a lot of new freshmen? Mm-hmm. That's exciting. Yeah. So what do you have to say? Um... What are your chances? Huh. <laughs> pretty good. It's pretty good? Yeah. What if you don't make it? I don't think that's gonna happen. <laughs> Not trying to be like. Right, I mean, yeah, but, that's awesome. Yeah. So, what did you, do you wanna do the cheer for us? No. Do you like the cheer? I don't even remember it. Oh my gosh. Is <laughs> it that's why I need to hang out with Natalie so I can practice it. Well, why aren't you hanging out with Natalie? 
I'm going to, but then I'm going to come back here because I slept over come, last night. Why doesn't she come over here? Oh, bet. You're right. I'll ask her. Um, Katie, was it a different chair than, like, a, chair, a new chair that you don't know? Like, it wasn't from last year. Did you like the dance? It's so fast. It's like, it's like, uh, it's like so fast. Holy like, cow. Is it too soft right now? Like something. I don't even know. It's like weird. Also, I need to find my spandex. Yes, we can. We'll they just you. dipped, and I don't know where they went, and I need to wear them because I hate wearing loose shorts for like. Okay. Well, stuff. let's search for them right now. You know? Yeah. <gasps> Is there anything that you felt unprepared for? Well, I like forgot how to do like all the arms. <laughs> <laughs> and I stunted me and Sarah and Dana, stunted with this girl who has literally never flown before. Oh, really? Or stunted, yeah. Now, one of the things she said, and I don't know if you told when you were vlogging, is that you're supposed to wear, cheer bows were encouraged. Did anybody have cheer bows on? Yes, so many people. And I was like, <laughs> were you the only one without it? No. All right, well, that's exciting. Well, welcome back. Thank you. Are you looking forward to tomorrow? Um, yes. Are you going to be sore? Probably not. Okay, that's good. I didn't do like, it wasn't like a workout. It was like a skill kind of thing. Yeah. Very good. <laughs> did you have to do that? No. <laughs> I did a front walk over or front handspring through to full wheel. Oh, you did? Yeah. Good. They had mats? What? Did they have mats? What do you mean? Like like cheer mats? Yeah, mat, well mats to tumble on. You didn't tumble on the hard floor. No, we never, yeah, no. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, they're like, yeah. Yeah. Hey, thanks, Brennan. Look at you. Huh? What's Tomorrow is another day of clinic, and then the actual tryout is on Friday. Oh, these are two clinics, mm -hmm. but it counts for tryout then? It's called tryouts, but it's okay. Do, do you think they're watching you and judging you on this day? Yeah. Like, okay. They're judging like how you get along with people and mm -hmm. how you learn and stuff. Yeah. Fantastic. Did you meet the other coaches? Yes. Okay. Paige is one of them. That's awesome. I know. So happy. Welcome back, Miss Paige. All right, Katie. Let's go look for your spandex. Mm, all right, you guys. I think we're gonna wind down the night. I'm sad that my uh, little boy is in at the beach, but I think he's having a great time. I miss him, so hopefully he'll share what made himself made himself what made him happy with his friends. I'm not sure, but what made me happy today was. I worked most of the day, but I think what made me happy today was Katie finally getting to try out for cheerleading. Well, she's been um, anxious about it. Actually, excited about it, not anxious, but excited about okay, it. Okay, so like... And eating at the Mexon. They just disappeared. Who? My spandex. They just disappeared <laughs> because none other of my clothes are gone. I think that is so weird. Only my spandex. Should you ask your brothers, do you think they, like, are playing a prank on you or something? If they are playing for me, I need to tell me right now because I need my... I don't know. I don't know. I'm, I'm being serious. Like, I have no idea where they are. Alright, everybody's making all kinds of noise while I'm trying to film. Sorry. Including you. You're the Sorry. noisiest of them all. What made me happy today was the fact that I think that, well, what made me happy today was having a Mexican, beautiful Mexican dinner <laughs> with my wife at the Mexican. And Mexican. you had a good day at work. At the Mexican, yes. Um, we should go to Cafe Rio. What? We should go to Cafe Rio. We should get a cat video? <laughs> but you cat should video. go to Cafe Rio. Oh, we, we should. <laughs> Here's the cat video. Hi, sweet girl. Hi, sweet baby girl. What made you happy today, Katie Elizabeth? First day of your tryouts. Success. We're making TikToks downstairs. Oh, you're making TikToks? Oh, yeah. Katie has two friends downstairs. And then we're going to come up here. Okay. And watch video. What are you going to watch? Probably The Longest Ride. Oh, very good. I love that movie. And try to get that again. I think we already ordered it once and it twice, twice and it expired. Excellent. We can't get it to work. Anyway, hopefully you can. Sound good? Um, I have a question. Yeah. Maybe this would be good vlog content. Oh. May I extend my curfew? What is your curfew right now? 11. And how old are you? 6, 15. 15. <laughs> hmm. Why do you need to be out past 11? Because I feel like 12 is a better curfew. Or 11.30 at least. 11.30? I think we can take it on a case by case. How about that? Well, ever since that one concert that I happened to be home after curfew, I haven't missed it since. 
Then it sounds like. And in fact, good. I've come home early every time. Is that right? Mm hmm. Oh, that's my girl. So, <coughs> so then you don't need to extend to 1130 for coming home early. No. Because then I will have more time and be less stressed the whole time I'm trying to have fun. <laughs> I see. All right, we'll take that into review. Thank you. You're welcome. I feel as if I have earned the right because I've always, I always tell you where I'm going. That's true. I always tell you who I'm with. That's like, true. I've never like gone and done stuff without asking you recently. <laughs> <laughs> Ever since that one mishap. Ever since that about. one mishap. <laughs> we should maybe but that was refer to that video right there. <laughs> which one is which one? Is I don't remember what it's called, but it was Katie gets grounded for something. But it's whatever. So okay. All right. I feel like I've earned it, yeah? All right, right. And I'm mature now, because I'm fifteen. That was when I was fourteen. See that's a throwback, yeah? I see, I see, I see. Well I think what we should do is let's get this school year rolling in good measure. And if we get that under control then we can consider. Sound good? Okay. All right, I love you. Good night, sweet dreams. Have fun tonight. Hey guys, P.S. Comment down below what you think Katie's curfew should be. She's 15. Comment down below what your curfew is. Actually, hold on. What? If you have a curfew past 11.30, comment. If you don't, don't comment. Because <laughs> people can be like, I'm not even allowed to go out and I'm 16. Exactly. And then you'd be like, ah! See? But it's different. Kay. Why? Huh? Why is it different? Because I'm a social butterfly. <laughs> you are a social butterfly. And I want to go hang out with my friends, you know? I know. And you do have a lot of friends who are older and have longer curfews, which is sort of a detriment of having older friends. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you guys. So comment down below. Oh, oh. Whatever. And Whatever. Talk soon. Bye. Bye. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.